He hath made us accepted in the beloved. If you've been accepted in the beloved, then you're secure. Why did he do that? Because he predestinated you to the adoption of children by Jesus Christ. Why? Because he chose you before the foundation of the world in him. All of this goes back to God's desire, and that's where our security comes from. Amen. We live in a day where we've been returned back to what Paul taught, back to the true security, and that security goes all the way back to the mind of God before the foundation of the world, before anything was spoken to existence, before anything was created. Your security today is linked back to then. And you're just as secure today as you were as an attribute in his thought. This is what it means to that you're going to be in Ephesians again in Laodicea. What does that mean? There's a church that's coming back to what Paul taught, coming back to the security of eternal security, not in a false way where I'm eternally secure and I can do whatever I want where the Baptist ruined it, but through the real genuine revelation of who you actually are, who you are in the depths of your soul and what God had planned for you from before the foundation of the world so that we don't get tossed about like children. So that we don't get moved by everything that happens, where we can keep our feet planted on the rock of Jesus Christ, the revelation of who he is in this generation, and not run and not move and not get scared and not look for salvation from anywhere else but from the Lord. That's what this revelation is to do to us, amen? It's not for puff up, it's not for knowledge, it's not for argument. It's to keep your feet planted on the word so that you don't move in every trial in your life because God knew this before the foundation of the world. He knew I would be here. He planted his seed within me. He sent the water of the word to bring this seed to life. I've been in the sunlight of this message growing into his image. What do I have to be afraid of and why do I have to run around scared? He's known this before the foundation of the world. That's what this revelation in the end time is supposed to do to us. Bring security. Not insecurity. Not, not you have to do this to be a believer and you have to do that to, to be in the message and you have to have this. That all breeds insecurity, but the word brings security that I am who I am by the grace of God and he's called me. He's drawn me. I'm in his hand. He knew me before the foundation of the world. He planted my feet upon a rock, the rock of this revelation and now I cannot be moved not because of what I've done but because of what he determined before the foundation of the world when he made me a accepted in the beloved. I don't have to perform things. I don't have to accomplish things. I don't have to manifest things. 